Today, got where was where's the milk start from? Yorkshire, Yorkshire, Yorkshire. That was a bad so we got Black Sheep Brewery with milk stout. Milk stout. Yeah. Little backstory, guys. About how long ago would you say it was? I think Over it was two years ago. I'd yeah, say. I think it was before the pandemic. Before the yeah, before the yeah. pandemic. I'd say two, three years ago. Joe's dad actually recommended this beer and we bought some from Tesco but for some reason you didn't drink it I think you said your dad drank it yeah so I guess he likes it and then I drank it and I can't say I was a fan from what I remember yeah but it says here world beer United Kingdom winner and creamy rich and dark 4.4 that sounds like a now. <laughs> <laughs> Founded by Paul oh, Feekston, the original black sheep. What? Why <laughs> a sheep? A sheep founded this. An award winning silky. By the way, we are a bit smashed. This is our uh, fifth. If, in case you haven't realised, we're wearing the same clothes because all these episodes, <laughs> this one we just included, and the next one is all going to be in one sitting. And then we're going to do the next six episodes in the next sitting. So that's 12 beers between two sessions. And this will last us six weeks, pretty much. One beer <laughs> a week, bam. So an award-winning silky creamy stout packed, packing notes of chocolate, vanilla, Co and coffee. Ooh. Brewed with lactose and a robust malt blend, this milk stout offers a satisfying sweetness that cuts against the light bitterness. Brought together through an ir irresistibly velvet texture. And I can confirm no spoilers alert, but that shit is all bullshit because when I had this, it was anything but. Maybe now that we're hammered, we might enjoy yeah. it a bit more. We might turn into a proper connoisseur and be like, yeah, ah, this is the wine. Do you want to show the, uh, I will show you, you the, show bottle. the bottle off? I think the bottle looks a bit like bulky, mate. It looks, it looks fun, man. Mm. So this is the bottle. It looks like a very Willy Wonka, Charlie and the Chocolate Factory-esque. I kind of get what you mean. Yeah. With all the squiggly writing. I really do get what you mean. Yeah, you got the top bit here. You got the... How was that? Oh, the gold in 2019. <laughs> <laughs> That's completely gone out of focus. Uh, World's Best Beer Awards. Mate, it's got quite a lot. Wow. we we, we got a record holder on our... Um, record on Yeah. <laughs> and then, um, I like the cap. The cap is... Quite good. It's a ram. It's a ram, stand, yeah. Yeah. I like rams. That's a bit weird. <laughs> On Skyrim, I'm gonna get a ram. Go. <laughs> Wait, it's just something about 2019 here. So that must have been when we tried it, or when yeah. I tried it. <laughs> <laughs> Adam and my dad were the uh, judges. <laughs> so Yorkshire. So we've been from Brighton, so somewhere in Germany, to Kentish. Yeah. To Kent. Kent. And then to Dorset, and now we're in Yorkshire. Yorkshire. This is very. This season. Where the hell does that come from? Fruity's definitely going to be European. Yeah. You can just tell. It's going to be like French or Italian or something. I reckon. But anyway, milk stout. Um, I'm willing to give it a go again. Four point four hours. Right, do you want to crack it open? Yeah, I'll be the. I'm going to say the cracker. <laughs> <laughs> you be the. Oh, wait, the cracker. Um. Oh, oh God. <laughs> You know what? They don't just seem to fizz up though. Yeah. <laughs> this, is, this is a bit of a frother. <laughs> right. Oh god, it's dark as fuck. I don't. Actually, to be fair, I drank it straight out of the bottle. That looks like Pepsi, but with. I can only get the coffee texture. Oh. That is literally 50% alcohol, 50% head. That kind of fucked up your one. <laughs> Or I fucked up mine. <gasps> go, go down, go down, go down, go down, 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 
Damn. So this is definitely a frothy one. Yeah. I'll pour it quite soon. Jesus Christ, I've poured nothing in there. It's <laughs> all right. Wait, let me feel. What's that? Oh, wow. I can smell the coffee. Jesus Christ. Damn, that is, yeah. Why do you even need to get that close? I can smell it from here. Because when one has had this much alcohol, one never knows. <laughs> It kind of, you know what, maybe, you know what, Roy, I think I'll like this. Why? When I first had this, I only had really drank rum, beer, whiskey, vodka, but my favourite drink is Palua, the Mexican coffee liqueur. My favourite drink liqueur. is a white or black Russian, mm. and maybe having appreciated that and started to do it myself, I'll actually like this drink a yeah. bit more. Gonna so really I'm going to go in here with an open mind because I can't actually remember how it tastes. I just remember I didn't like it. But then again, you wouldn't mix coffee liqueur with like ale or lager, so. Mm. I don't know. This has been the messiest one to put. Yeah, Why is that such a perfect square as well? <laughs> little square. Mine's like all marshy and whatnot, and then yours is just like a perfect square. By the way, we're not pouring this onto a uh, table, by the way. This is actually a shoebox. <laughs> shoebox on a bucket. This is a River Island shoebox that, in the video, looks like a table. <laughs> what would you get the bucket for? The beer maker? Yeah. <laughs> I need to deep clean that. So it's like, we, we were actually going to make beer after this, but I really don't think that's going to happen now. <laughs> right, screw it. I feel like we should just drink it and then just share the rest right there. All right. Don't go too mad with the bottle because there's still stuff in there. 4.4? 4. 4. Let's go. Cheers. I don't think that tastes that nice. That's no, no, no. I mean, <laughs> I don't think that tastes that bad. No, I agree with the first session. That does not taste nice at all. It just tastes like coffee. It just tastes it like tastes coffee. It like really, really strong coffee. I drink coffee all the time. I'm one of those guys that I get up. Recently, I've been having white coffee, but usually I have black coffee, so I'm used to a strong coffee taste. This tastes like coffee and ale. I just think this tastes like coffee. I don't really have coffee, to be fair. I'm, I'm a tea drinker. Do you want more? Yep. I'll have a little bit more. You know what? <sighs> Clearly, alcohol has not affected my opinion, because this is exactly how I felt when I drank it for the mm. first time. Milk stout is definitely not my favourite drink. I think we're going to be kind of polar opposites. I'm, I, I rate this. This is my second favourite. So it's above the Erdinger. No, it's below the Erdinger, Erdinger but just above, above everything else. Yeah. But yeah, just above the Thirsty Ferret and Dark Star. Yeah, but have you noticed that on every single drink we've come to a conclusion based between our two opinions? So at the end... Our opi their overall opinion is actually a combination of our mm, opinions. I suppose so, yeah. So we've gone from the Black Star Hophead, which was a 4. Erdinger we both rated 5. 1698 we rated a 3. And then Thirsty Ferret... No, we rated a 2, didn't we? Yeah. And Thirsty Ferret was a 4. So our individual opinions are like the individual like taste, appearance and whatnot. But overall, we actually have to come to a conclusion yeah. together. It's going to be where it splits... I'm not a fan of that at all. That is not nice. Coffee and beer just... You know, at, one, at work once, I mixed coffee and cola. Coffee and it cola? Tasted to, no, I, looked, I looked online and apparently that was a thing, so I tried it. <laughs> and it was disgusting. And this does not taste that what much different. What was that hangover cure that, that... I don't know what it's called. I'm going to call him Dave. Dave? Yeah, it was just like um, Coca-Cola and orange juice or something. I tried that, and then at work, everyone started laughing at me and was like, Adam, you're going to be off sick in a couple of days. And guess what? I was off sick in a couple of days. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it was that guy you used to work with, Sam. Sam? Oh, that was his name. The cockney guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I completely forgot. Who was actually really tall, but next to you he looked short, and it was only when he stood next to Mo. I was like, hang on. Why does he tower over Mo? And I was like, actually, he's not that short. It's just next Wait, to he, you. He was the big bull guy, wasn't he? With the glasses, yeah. 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 yeah, it came up to me. It was just like, you right, Joe? I was just like, yeah. She's like, when you got your HGV? I was just like, oh, 
Hi, Paul. <laughs> I completely forgot his name. <laughs> Sam, I don't remember. Sam. You know what? I swear I saw Antonio the other day, like... When did I see him? Maybe... What was he doing? Shooting up some gangsters. Ba -bam, ba -bam. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was... It was either when I came back from uni on the Wednesday, or when I was going to the bus stop for work. No, it must have been uni because of the way I was coming out. So it must have been <laughs> Wednesday or Tuesday. I can't remember. And he was scrubbing something off Cleveland, near Cleveland Road. Mm. I was going to make conversation, but I was in a rush. <laughs> Tuesday morning it was, I think. There we go. <laughs> <coughs> I can safely say, in, I'm not enjoying this drink. At first, I was enjoying it. Now the coffee's worn off. This is the first drink that I'm actually really reluctant to put in my mouth. At first, I was just like, this is well nice. And now the coffee's just gone. And now it just tastes it like doesn't it. taste that nice. <laughs> I'd say it's in line with my stout that I made. So it might just be a stout thing. I probably don't like stout. But actually, think Why is Guinness a stout? Yeah, but there's something about Guinness that I can like. Guinness is weird. It's well weird. It isn't like any other stout. I can safely say that out of all of them, the only one that is in league with is probably the 69. You look fucked. <laughs> I feel fucked. <laughs> Luckily, the next one looks like it will be quite an easy yeah. one. Yeah. That looks like something from India. <laughs> it just looks... <laughs> <laughs> I kind of hope it is, because so far, this whole thing has been one German and four English. It looks like you'll get that from a comma shop. Like a... Not even a... Yeah, like a... Yeah. In, like a, maybe a Middle Eastern, like Turkey or... Yeah. Kazakhstan yeah, yeah, or Iran or something, like, something like where you just get a random... It's strawberries. It's a strawberry beer. It doesn't look like something you'd get in the UK, put it that way. Not a milk. Milk <laughs> stout. It's like a milk beer. But you wouldn't really, like, can you imagine growing milk in a Foster's? No. Well, One day we'll have to try that. <laughs> I've tried... Do you, do you know the manor? The yeah. manor, I like. So, um, they done one song called, um... Cornflakes and Guinness. What? He literally poured Guinness and cornflakes <laughs> and ate it. Like midway through the song. It's quite a sick song, but he literally poured cornflakes and Guinness. Uh, poured, poured Guinness and cornflakes. Just like, what uh, the fuck? <laughs> it was just like, it's fucking taste shit. <laughs> yeah, I'm not surprised. <laughs> just like, what the fuck was I thinking? <laughs> like I said, I think the Coca Cola and coffee was just a I don't know what I was expecting, but it was really horrible. Did you have milk in it as well, or was it? No, 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 it was just like an black, espresso. Yeah. No, black coffee with uh, Coca-Cola. That's espresso water and coffee mm. and Coca-Cola. Ah, uh, that's like shit. I thought it'd give the coffee like a sparkly taste, mm. but it just gave it a shit taste. I'd actually say this tastes worse than 16. Yeah, 1698, I don't remember actually wanting to sort of like with this one, I don't like. My, my enjoyment has just gone there. <laughs> it was at an all time high and then whoop. Because it's milk, it sounds nice. But then they can put anything. <laughs> I think they just chummed it up. <laughs> you know what? They can put anything on the bottle and you'll think that tastes I nice. Think, I think it looks it. really nice. The design, it grabs you. I feel like that was the reason why I was just like, this is going to fucking taste nice. I don't know, wait, what's this little HMF thing? I don't know, it was called cool. Human Milk Foundation. That sounds weird. Human milk. And cow's milk. It's <laughs> fucking human milk. That's Pregnant right. women. <laughs> <laughs> Judge some milk stout. Yeah, but that is like literally matte black, whereas the yeah. 1698 was actually... Yeah, I can't see anything through there. That's darker than a Guinness. Yeah. That is literally what coffee looks like. See, with the Guinness, it's a bit browner. With the... I don't know actually, but with the 1698, it actually was more. That's very dark. dark. What taste has this got? Oh! <laughs> chocolate, chocolate, vanilla, and coffee. The vanilla, I can kind of taste a little vanilla, bit. Vanilla, I can't taste. Coffee, I can. Coffee. Chocolate, I can't. You say another thing? No, just chocolate, vanilla, and coffee. God, that is. Ugh. That's ghastly. Ugh. <laughs> I right, think this right. is going to be the longest phrase. Yeah. Right, taste. What are you going to say? I'm going to put that down as a one. one. Like, yeah, one. 
at least the 60 minutes yeah i could sort of stomach it without yeah. feeling sick but this i feel and not normally the more you drink the more you can handle it so like sober it could be a, a zero <laughs> But one for the taste. I'd say the design of the bottle is pretty funky. It's, it's nice. Um, I'd say a four. 3.5. 3.5 we'll go with. Um, and the cap. Yeah, 3.5. Yeah, I'll give that a oh, four. I, I'll, I'll go four. Um, enjoyment. I was enjoying. No, then I'm going to give that a two. <laughs> yeah, two. So that's a one, two, and a three. What are we going to two? Two. Right in the middle. Two. But I feel like the 1698 was a bit better than that. I feel like it doesn't deserve to be. I might give that a one, you know. Nah. I feel like it was a letdown. I feel like what you're expecting and what you get is a letdown. It's a one. It's gonna be a one. Yeah? It's a one. Okay, it's a one. <laughs> <laughs> Still a little bit left. Uh... Guys, we found the five, and in the same series, we found the one. Oh, so we're doing this series by series. That makes sense. Well, this this is all going to be the first series. Yeah. And that's, that's going to be first series, or second series. Yeah. Oh, sweet. Cool. So, six episodes per series. Yeah, mate, that, that'll be cool. So, in this series, we found a five, a one, two fours, and a two. That's a pretty yeah. overall... Yeah. Hopefully, this is going to be a three. Well, hopefully it's going to be five. Well, hopefully it's a five. If not, it could be a three. I reckon it's going to be a four. Three yeah. or a four. Yeah, I don't think it'll be a five. I don't think. I feel like five. looking at think. looking at these um these two bottles, you can just tell they're going to be. Yeah, I feel like there's something about these. Like look look at the. What, what, why were you facing to me? Like <laughs> the camera's near me. But the color scheme of these bottles is quite colorless. It's just black and white, and I feel like, yeah, I feel like that kind of reflects its taste. Whereas the other ones, they're colourful, they've got something to them. Whereas these are very, you either love it. These are like marmite. You either love it or hate it. And we fucking hate it. And we fucking hate it. <laughs> right. So the milk stout is a one, and that's generous in my opinion. Mm. I think I think the design of the bottle. You like the design of the bottle, but even I, I feel like the, it's good, it's average, but it's not. Mm. It, it didn't really grab me like the others. Right. So, um, yeah, one. Right. So, this has been RD Brewery with um, Milk Stout. How about it? It's got that name. Ram. Black Black Sheep. Black Sheep. Um, milk Stout. Don't buy it, it tastes like shit. The worst one we've had so far. Buy it, taste it, see what you think. Well, you probably we don't, don't really like, like it. it. Yeah. <laughs> we don't like it. <laughs> so, um, anyway, this has been RD Brewery. And we'll see you in the next episode where we'll finish off with some Fruly. Fruly? So, <laughs> stick around for the season finale. Yeah. Hopefully, we'll get another five after a, a one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Anything's better than this. Anything. So, yeah. Right, thanks for watching and goodbye my friends. Bye. That's like the classic outro, isn't it?